Well, I was looking to speak to a Royce O'Connell. Something tells me I'm speaking to him right now. Something told you right. I ain't a marshal no more. Ain't been for three years. Well, from what I've heard, you were a hell of a marshal back in the day. Quick on the draw with your black-eyed Suzanne. We have some U.S. Marshals that have been kidnapped over the past few weeks. Conway's behind it. I couldn't prove he was guilty three years ago, and I doubt I can help you find him now. You're not happy here. There's no future for you. You know that, right? Maybe I don't like the future. You and all those big steam machines you've got back east. You know, there's a reason I've stayed here so long. Like your wife? Careful what you say next, Marshal. Me and my men will be just outside of town, due east. Eight o'clock. Don't be late. Hey Jim, you said you could find Conway. Never said I could find him. I said I had to leave. You can run on for a long time. Named Sophie Sandefield. I reason to believe that she was doing business with Conway. Tell him God is gonna let you down. Tell him that God's gonna cut you down. Hold her finished off. For good this time. And you three are going to die. I've got my pistols and my horse and a Bible in my pocket, and that's all I've ever needed. Say when, Conway! This is the future! Stop shooting at it! Yeah! The cell's in turmoil right now, Marshal. No! No! Faith and trust ain't the same thing, sister. Sure they are. No, they ain't. Well, they could be. We may have to declare martial law. Tell them that God's gonna cut you down.